Okay, so... There is not a lot left of this game, to be honest. Um... And the dead factory. Just a few loose ends to tie up. I think those are just blue orbs. I'm gonna leave those alone. Ah, another one of those renowned puzzles. <laughs> not really, but, you know, it's still... It's a puzzle nonetheless. It's not too difficult. Um... Oh, crap. Let's go, Jelly Bean. See if we can solve this puzzle. It's not really a puzzle, but... You know, um... I've actually been thinking about this for a while. I've played all of the Resident Evil pretty much... I will admit, Zero is the only one I haven't played, and yes, I will be doing a blind let's play of that. <laughs> and puzzle-wise, I do think 3 is definitely up there. Because, I don't know, the puzzle, like, it's... Obviously, some puzzles are, you know, more number-based. And there we go, here's the power restored. Anyway, um, yeah, some puzzles are more number-based, some are more visual, like the one that we're about to come upon. In Resident Evil 2, it's really just a matter of collecting this and that. Whoa. Almost steamed myself right there. You were almost a steamed Jill sandwich. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that was lame. Um, but yeah. I, I don't know why she didn't just crawl under the steam, by the way. That's what I would do. I mean, kind of risky. Maybe I'd get, like, burned real bad, but it feels like it might work. And... Oh, this place is just... This place kind of ga always gave me the creeps, just because it's like a dead factory, you know, it's not really used. Well, it was used, but it was... Oh! Hmm. Hello, Mr. Bugman. Yeah, that's right. Hiss all you want. I think there's another one around here. Oh, there it is. Come down, Mr. Oh, I totally missed it. Come down! And Mr. Bugman shall not bother us anymore. Okay, now since I'm out of handgun bullets, and I'm pretty sure you don't get any more. I'm just gonna reload this real quick. I think I'm. I am actually going to take this opportunity to test out a new toy. Where? Where are you, Mr. Scientist Zombies? Can she, like, see them from here? No, it doesn't look like she... Uh, what is that? Oh, they're all over there! Take the opportunity, Jill! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know if those mines can, like, hurt you. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, but... Uh, oh, nice, nice. As you can see, um... The mines scatter, like you can also you can attach them to enemies, but you can also um do right there. You can also like blow them up. Or oh shit! Put them on a surface. And basically enemies will walk into them. Uh I think that's all for I think that's all for today, kids. We blew up all the scientist zombies. But, what was I gonna say? Yeah, it's just a very trick, uh, kind of tricky weapon because you have to time your ta attacks right because, you know, it, they don't detonate instantly. So, you can either place them somewhere and have, like, a cluster of enemies conveniently walk into it, or you can, uh... Oh, I can't go in there yet. Or you can just attach them to enemies, but yeah, obviously you get the best results from having enemies all get nice and piled up somewhere. Whew, okay. Well on our way. Well on our way. Ah! Um... Oh my god, it still grabbed me and I dodged you! Mm, you stupid fool! Ah! <sighs> 
god! I hate these things. I officially hate these things. Are there any more? Huh. How did I kill this one? It was like way the hell over here. Well, I'm not knocking it, but you know. God damn. So yeah, I apologize for that. Rest in pieces. <laughs> Headphone users. No, not rest in pieces. Rest in peace. I'm just messing with you. I know the saying. I'm not that stupid. I'm a little stupid sometimes, but yeah. Enough about my stupidity. Guys, can you seriously picture a worse place than this? Like, to be or to work at a worse place than this during the zombie apocalypse? Because uh, I seriously can't. I mean, hunters. Or, hunters? What, what the hell am I saying? The hospital. Sorry, I thought it was hunters down there. That's why I said hunters. Um, the hospital would obviously be a pretty bad spot. Oh, wow. So, yeah, a hospital and a, pla a place like this, you know, like a disposal plant or maybe a graveyard. Oh, my God. Absolutely horrible. I mean, t a ton of diseases, like not even just the virus. Shit ton of corpses. So, yeah, that's where you'll get the most amount of zombies the fastest. Uh, just no. Stay away from them. There it is. Let's read it. Because, I mean, that diary from that poor guy we found earlier, that's like a perfect example. It's just full of disease and... Like, even if it's not a deadly disease, you know, you can still get sick a lot. I would no way in hell I'd work there, no matter how good the pay is. Um, Since this plant is a facility in the disguise of a deserted factory, civilians will sometimes enter. What? So basically, if, if there's like a bunch of kids nearby playing ball or whatever in the park, and some of them, like, they accidentally throw a... Uh, ball here or something, and then they want to go get it, they'll get shot? That's fucked up! Umbrella. Oh, okay. If they surrender, um... Arrest and transfer them to the... Aw, oh, but that's no better. They'll be used as a guinea pig, so... <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Yeah, epidemic pre prevention system. Oh. Imagine being locked in that place, guys. That'll be my worst nightmare. Alright. Oh, this. We have to grab this. But yeah, those freaking bug things were taking a bath in that nasty pool. Ugh. I mean, come on, guys. If you want to take a shower, take a proper shower. Not, not in like a nasty decomposition pool. No, I actually don't need to go here yet. Well, actually, no. I'm gonna put some... God damn, Jill, turn around. I'm gonna put some stuff away. Just real quick. Bear with me. Come on. There we go. My PlayStation is kind of sluggy, uh, sluggish sometimes. Like, um... It'll get caught up in the transition of this. I think I'll keep the rest. Oh, I think I forgot to grab the, uh, the disc from that table, didn't I? Or did I? I don't remember right now. Let's see. Yeah, but I don't need it right now, so it's cool. Uh, what do we have in here? Is that a dead rat? Kinda looks like it. Ah, oh, people, people, this is seriously one of the worst, um puzzles in the game. I remember when I was a kid, I used to uh, 
like I couldn't figure out what you had to do, so I just sat there with my block and did like all these combinations, you know, because there's like A, B, and C, and you can turn them left and right. And I just tried all possible combinations. I sat there with my pen and paper until I got it right, and it's just wow. I freaking hate this puzzle. <sighs> Okay. Pain in the ass is this w is what this puzzle is. I mean, it's visual. It's supposed to be simpler, but it's just not. Sometimes when you get some of these weird patterns, um. see here sorry for being quiet I'm just trying to focus a little bit uh, right hold on Maybe something like this. Hell yes! Ugh. Finally. Fair enough. There we go. That room is finally open. Uh, let's just make sure I have everything. Water, blah, blah, blah. Can I do anything else with this? Ultraviolet rays are applied to the water. No. Alright. Some kind of a code pattern. Yes, indeed it is, and I know exactly for what. But, we are not quite going there yet. Whew. This place is just absolutely horrific. Give me a moment here, ladies and gentlemen. I am just gonna restock. Okay, so... Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you see, I have stocked up on quite a bit. Well, not so much, really, but, um... I did have a lot of gunpowder left, and as you can see, I made I actually made 61 magnum rounds. Well, I already had a few, but, you know... My golly god. Uh, I also made some acid rounds and some shotgun shells, even though I'm not even gonna use the shotgun. Like, the amount of ammunition you get in this game is just insane. In frickin' sane. I mean, come on, like, okay, yeah. I get that they wanted us to have... <laughs> I don't know, maybe maybe it's because I haven't been fighting Nemesis, I guess that's a fair point, but yeah. Let us disregard that. Point is, we have way more than enough, so... Uh, this is totally pointless, by the way. Is it another one? Oh, there it is. Come here, Mr. Bug. Come here, Mr. Buggy Bug. What are you doing? Being all buggy. Yay! I think I killed it. By the way, what? This place just makes no sense. This pool, um... And by the way, uh, I read somewhere not, not too long ago, actually, that this is a uh, dead factory, or 
disused plant or whatever you call it is actually not the right term for this. It's supposed to be called uh, Incineration Disposal Facility 12PA or something like that. That's like the official name. Which sounds pretty cool. Dead Factory sounds kind of lame. Oh yeah, before I forget, I have to get this disc that I forgot earlier. This whole place is just... my god. What the hell were they thinking? Like I said earlier, a bunch of kids could just come in playing and they would be discovered. I mean, it's not really that much of a secret factory. And what were they thinking? Jesus Christ. With the amount of, uh, like, things that they needed to dispose of, you know, organic material or whatever, they should have known they would get swamped. Oh, damn. Still wandering around. Nikolai? So, you want to get out of here alone? Is that your plan? I made certain none of the other supervisors survived. Since I'll be the only one who knows what really happened, I'll have more bargaining power when it comes to discussing my bonus. Then why kill me? I'm not on their payroll. Yes, you are. What you eliminated for reasons of their own. The amount is modest, but there is a reward to be claimed upon the confirmation of your death. That's great, except I have no intention of contributing to your retirement fund. Oh, god damn. I think Nikolai just retired. And ladies and gentlemen, that is not tomato sauce. Oh god damn, you're looking gorgeous, aren't you? <laughs> Nemesis literally just squeezed the blood out of him. That is awesome. Oh right, I can't get in here yet. Uh doo -doo -doo, just like this. What doesn't make sense about that, by the way, is Nemesis is supposed to go for stars, like that's his first priority. It kinda went for Nikolai first. Maybe it's because it's been so damaged that's kind of lost sight of its purpose. Just Warning. maybe, and oh my god, this room is... This room is incredibly freaky. Imagine this, being locked pretty much inside of a contamination pool. You have four minutes to get out, you have to fight a big-ass freaking monster. And if you don't get out within the four-minute time frame, you are gonna be pretty much dissolved along with the rest of the corpses here and this this thing whoa 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 that should actually have hit her I don't know how it didn't she like it defied gravity or something but yeah that is the liquid I mean it's supposed to like take down even nemesis shit Oh. Uh, hmm, may as well waste these. Have some freeze rounds. Oh god! Whew. Oh, he does not like that. Wish I had more of these. Oh wait, I have one more. No, I can't see him. That's a bad camera. Anyway. Um, use some of these just for the hell of it. I love acid rounds. God damn it, caught me! No! Oh, the heavy attack. Oh! Being thrown around like a freaking basketball. Get up, chill, get up! Oh my god, no, 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 no. Get up. God damn. You fast, a nemesis. Oh my god, it still caught me. <laughs> Get up, Jill. What? I have, to, I have to get some distance. Oh, I hate that freaking camera angle. I need to see how many I have left. 
There we go. Take that, you bastard. So, we totally killed Nemesis. Kinda, sorta. <laughs> Let's have a nice look. Look at all these freaking bodies. What doesn't make sense is... If there was an overflow of bodies and um, organic material that they needed to dispose of, why is this room not very full? Because this is basically the main pool. Oh, crap. It just makes... It doesn't quite make sense. Uh, and further... You know, I'm actually wondering... Okay, so uh, they received, you know, failed experiments, bodies, all that stuff. And watch this. Oh my god. This is creepy. But yeah, anyway, they received all these um, materials and experiments that they wanted to dispose of and bodies and everything like that, you know, chemicals. Uh, from all the laboratories in Raccoon City and... It's just, how come they didn't expect an overflow, you know? This is a small-ass laboratory, er, a small-ass facility and it's not really capable of like, what the hell were they thinking? And furthermore, how did they transport all that stuff? I don't think it would be very convenient to like use a regular truck or something. So I'm wondering if this is like somehow connected to the underground labs and has some secret passage. That would actually be kind of interesting to find out more about. Oh, I hear zombies. Damn! I <laughs> didn't switch weapon. There we go, Jill. Oh, wait. I may as well use this one. Just for the hell of it. That's full already? Okay. I love this. Just really using the magnum. Check this out. Uh, I think it's all down. It's just a very strange place, and like I said, I just feel sorry for the staff. 